Hello again and welcome to this recording um, in our series on Active Directory demos. So again, we're doing some demonstration on Active Directory certificate services. So in this particular short demo, we'll be showing how to publish a root CA certificate through group policy. Um, this is really straightforward. This won't be long. So uh, I'm currently on a domain controller, LON DC1. We're doing, doing this through uh, group policy. So let's bring up the group policy management console. Expand forests. Um, expand it at .com. Let me expand this one more. So I can just use the default domain policy and edit it. So there's nothing wrong. You can do it either way. It depends on your preference. You can use the default. It's advisable not to buy. Some people give the advice of not editing your default domain policy. Well, I would say it's something of preference. Um, some people say just create separate uh, group policy object to do uh, any modifications that you need to make. So again, let's just use default domain policy for this demo. If you're using a custom one, just create a custom group policy object and apply the same settings. So I'll go on the computer configuration in this case, expand policies, expand Windows settings, expand security settings after that. And then you go on the public key policies. So forgive the slowness of this server. Then if you go on the security settings and then and then I'll go on the public key policies in this case. So public key policies, and we have the trusted root certification authorities here. Uh, so what I'll do is I'm going to import the root CA certificate in here. So if I just right click on it and then click on import certificate. I want it in the local machine store. Um, I'll go browse and select the location where my root CA or the root CA I want to add is saved. In this case, it's saved on the launch server one. I'll go under the administrative share. So that's the root CA there. And if I click open next, um, place all certificates in the following store because it's a trusted root certificate. Therefore, it goes in this trusted root certificate certification authority store. And I'll go next and finish. And then shortly, you should see that apply here. So it might take, it might just take a few seconds. Yeah, import was successful. And there we go. This is now um, showing in the uh, in group policy object. Uh, so what I can do is if I go on another machine, this is another domain controller in my domain, but in this case, uh, if I bring up MMC on this machine, and I have to be fast with this demonstration because domain controllers, I think by default, do a group policy refresh every five minutes. So let's open up the certificate console. I don't know, snapping certificate, and we'll bring up the local computer certificate store in this case and let's expand it and then let's go on the trusted with certification authorities and on the certificate so we have atom c here 